a new home. That's pretty big time. Army veteran Jennifer Andresen got the keys to her new home herself and her new service dog, Eddie, as well. Renata Urorio has the story all new for us at noon. This is Army veteran Jennifer Andreessen. It's hard for me to express because there's no words to express like that kind of like spinny feeling you get on the inside. On Thursday, she and her service dog Eddie were surprised with a brand new home from Canines for Warriors and JWB Real Estate Capital. So Rory came up to me when I was at Canines for training for Eddie and he's like, hey, do you want a house? And I was like, I'm sorry, excuse me. I want to say that I'm grateful and I'm excited and at the same time I'm kind of nervous because it's new. There are four bedrooms in this house and now it all belongs to Andreasen and her dog Eddie. First thing I thought was like I don't know what I'm gonna do with all this space. <laughs> the second thing is like this is my space now. It's Andreasen's first home and the first time she won't be living with her parents since her time in the military. Her mother there's very few times in your life where you have these moments where it is so clear when you see your child struggling so long after they've served their country and gone through all of these things to see the number of people who can come behind you and give them a new start and give them a boost of confidence that they've needed to regain who they were before they got lost. And I have so many plans for all of the rooms in this house. Like one, A new be, start, a like new type of freedom, kind of after serving and ensuring freedom for the country. Renata DiGorario, First Coast News, on your side. Happening tonight, family and friends will remember